I'm Star and welcome to my channel Starlight Star Rate 70. If you're returning, thank you so much for coming back. And if you are new, welcome. Come on in. So <laughs> this morning I put out a video. Well, actually, I did a video this morning. I recorded a video of um, me working on my last square on my Pocahontas. Uh, it is for Diamond Grandma's event called her Cultural 24. Uh, and Teresa Journey is her co-host. But anyway, so uh, my plan was to record me actually working on it, piecing it together, and putting out a really nice video. Yeah, well, guess what? I fell asleep. <laughs> I fell asleep while I was diamond painting. And yeah, when I woke up, well, yeah, we, got, we had a few drills everywhere. And um, it was, yeah, it was a mess. <laughs> But guess what guys, I did get her complete and we are going to be looking at her in a bit. But um, I do have a PR uh, package that was sent to me from um, Art Dot. They reached out to me and they asked me if I would try one of their products and I said sure. So I went and checked out their website and they do have a variety of items. They have a couple diamond paintings, but mostly um, diamond painting accessories I'll say. So, so yeah, but they also are on Amazon, so if you're interested in that. Um, but we can go through all that when we test out their product. Um, before we go any further though, I want to do our Love and Light series. We've been doing this one. We've Actually, I think we started out with this one. Um, but anyway, uh, Doreen Virtue is the one that created these cards. Um, it's called Love and Light, and they are of Divine Guidance. So, uh, today's card says, leave a trail of love as you walk the earth. It says, oh Lord, what a variety of things you have made. In wisdom, you have made them all. Psalms 104, 24. And I just love the Psalms. And there is the card. And he has, he has created, he has made everything. He even made you. He knew you before you were born. He created all the stars, and can you believe he knows every name of the stars? Every name. So yes, he has created everything. And it says, Oh Lord, what a variety of things you have made, and wisdom you have made everything. So, and that is so, so true. All right, so that's our card for today. And I wanna do a quick shout out. So I attended a live uh, this afternoon. It was kind of this evening, but, um, and this couple, I think it's a couple, and I'm not sure um, if the other lady that was there is their daughter or a relative. I'm not sure, but anyway, I have to, I have to find that that all out. <laughs> what their connection is? What is their connection? But anyway, so I just want to give them a shout out. Um, it was a really cute couple. Uh, let me just get to YouTube here. Uh, the channel's name is L and L Diamond Painting, and that stands for Lenora and Lee. Um, they started their channel; it looks to be about six months ago, and right now they have 303 subscribers and they have 51 videos. And this is the channel right here. Whoops! Uh, they were involved in an event for Wizard of Oz this month. Oh dear! Turned out. <laughs> hey, how come that turned to mine? What the heck? Hold on. Let me go back. Oh dear. Let me go home. There we go. <laughs> anyway, there we go. Oh, you know what? I'm going to turn off the turn off my TV here. There we go. Because otherwise there's a glare. Always forget to turn the TV off. But there is their channel right there. And the lady that was with them was, uh, her name is Tammy. And I'm just going to go to my subscribes because I had just subscribed to her. And let's see if I can get to her. Let me see. There we go. So, Tamitha, I think is her real name, but everyone seems to call her Tammy. She has 23 videos out there and she has 190 subscribers. So, it says Diamond Painting with NMD. And I'm just going to wait because there's people going live. I have really been enjoying going to lives lately, uh, meeting new people, uh, spreading my wings out there in this diamond painting community. It is incredible. Um, so yeah. But anyway, that's her channel there. 
She says, hi, my name is Tammy. I have been an avid diamond painter for the past 2.5 years after my young cousin recommended it and helped me set up my first painting. It quickly became my favorite pastime. Since beginning to diamond paint, my interests and skills have grown. I now have my own YouTube channel and collaborate with several other diamond painters. I was born with neuromuscular dis disease and constantly have limited mobile. However, diamond painting is something that I can do and honestly feel I do well. It has provided me with a hobby, helped me to make friends all over the world, and has given me self-confidence. Because of the fulfillment it has added to my life, it is my hope to share this art with others who may suffer from mental or physical disabilities or any challenge you may be facing. That is just so sweet. So anyway, so that is her, um, that is her channel. So I'm going to link both those channels in my description. Uh, please go share our RV love that we have here. Go give them a subscribe. Go give them a like on one of their videos and leave them a comment. Let them know that you're from the RV family. So I would so appreciate that. All right, so that is our shout out. Wonderful, wonderful. Anyway, there are so many lives out there. So um, if you guys, especially if you're wondering what to do one night that you say, say you're just on painting and you're flipping through the channels. And I do know that many of you probably have so many channels to watch, just like me. But every once in a while, it's just nice to attend a live, get involved, get to know uh, other creators out there, get to know other channels. It's just pure. It's just really, really amazing. All right, so like I said, I'm done my Pocahontas. And the um, product that the Art Dot wanted me to review is called um, Diamond Painting. It's a diamond painting sealer kit. So I thought, perfect, because I want to seal her. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to um, pause you. I'm going to set everything up here. And then uh, we will get started at sealing our diamond painting. Alrighty, I'm back. So here is Pocahontas. Um, this one had 40 colors. Uh, it is a center one diamond painting. Um, it has a, has a really nice soft backing. Um, it was a, it's a round, and I believe it had three ABs in it. Um, so yeah, there's her completion. She absolutely sparkles gorgeously. Uh, the little raccoons are adorable. Uh, I think she turned out absolutely beautiful. Now up close, she looks a little bit of a mess. <laughs> I really struggled with this one with the colors. I couldn't see them all. I should say the symbols. I could not see them all on this painting. But I worked away and I got her done. So I don't know. I guessed in some places. And I think she looks beautiful. And that is my Pocahontas. Now she is, uh, I'm not sure if I said this already, <laughs> so I'm re repeating myself, but she is for Diamond uh, Grandma, Grandma's Cultural Event 24. And Teresa Journey is her co-host. So um, thank you Diamond Grandma and thank you Teresa. I had so much fun um, joining your event this month. Absolutely beautiful paintings. My goodness, there are so many wonderful artists out there that diamond paint and others too. I know there's others that cross stitch as well and stuff. So you guys are just all so amazing. If you want to know uh, any further information about Diamond Grandma's events, please go visit her. She has, of course, she's got a channel and um, she will let you know everything you need to do if you want to join her event next month. Uh, Diamond Grandma does have events every month, so yes, and she, then she also has different co-hosts. So I do know that in order, if you do want to be entered in a um, drawing at the end of the month for her, or whenever she does her drawing, uh, you need to be um, subscribed to both her and Chase's Journey. Um, and that's basically all the requirements. And then also just, I think, post your picture on Facebook. I'm not even sure, but, um, but I believe that's it. But yeah, further information, yeah, go check out her channel, go ask her some questions. I'm sure she would be glad, glad to answer them for you. 
<laughs> but yeah, anyway, absolutely love how she turned out. I did roll her, so she is rolled already. And so this is what came in the mail. Oh my goodness, it is a nice big brown bag. And we are going to open it and see what's inside. I haven't even opened it yet. So yes. Oh, maybe I should open it this way. It says pull to open. Well, I'm just going to cut. How's that? I think cutting is better. As long as I don't cut myself. We're good. There we go. We are good. And here is the box. Ooh, it's heavy. So here is the box that came in it, that came in the uh, bag. And, oh, just a little, or just telling me what it is. Okay. So this includes a diamond painting sealer, one lint roller, one diamond painting fix tool, one silicone brush, and one paintbrush. So that's what all comes into here. So we are going to open up the box. Can you see that? I don't even know if you guys can see that. <laughs> so here's the box. So, oh, it comes with a lint roller and it's got, oh, this would be good for my clothes actually. If it's a lint roller. Ooh, and here is the sealer. And of course, it's all in plastic. Oh dear. That's a definitely oh dear for me. <laughs> and it's got two, so it's got a silicone paintbrush. It's got a little scraper here. And then it also has this paint. Oh, I love the paintbrushes. They sparkly. Look at those. So yeah, really, really nice. Of course you have to open everything oh my goodness so we're gonna get the seal off of here let me just poke into here there we go hopefully that's good enough I'm gonna just try to lift you up just a little bit here so you can maybe just see a little bit more is that good? I know I've got my colorful dress on tonight, so it was so hot in here that I put on a nice little sundress here, and uh, it's damp. It's hot and it's damp. Uh, we've had rainstorms today. We've had thunderstorms. Um, so yeah, good day for sleeping. <laughs> All right, so we have that. And then let's get these brushes out. I'm just going to cut them. So this one is, ooh, nice and soft. So it's a very, very nice soft brush. Ooh, it's very, very soft. Very, very nice. So here's a brush, and then here's a silicone brush. Love the handles on these brushes. And yeah, so it's just silicone. And then this lint roller has tape on it, which, yeah, how am I going to open that? I don't even know. I'm not sure about this lint roller, uh, but I'm sure I probably have to shake this glue up, maybe. I'm not sure. Let's get rid of all this garbage here for now. Put it back in the box. And so, yeah, I think this is just like a normal lint roller. So maybe it's supposed to take all the fuzzies off your diamond painting if you have pets, which is really, really nice because I do. I have three cats. Um, I already went over with the roller and I picked out. What I do is I usually run it over with a, with a uh, toothbrush uh, and it gets it in between all the little places that has hair. I thought that was a hair, but it belonged to the, the brush there. Um, but it gets all the little hairs and everything out. Um, but yeah, I have no idea how what I'm doing here. So it does look like it has tape on it. Oh, I should lift you up a little bit more. Here, why don't we just do this? <laughs> I'm 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 trying to get the tape off of this roller here. There's just going to be a little bit of up and downs today. How's that?
yeah, I don't know. Try to try it with my scissors here. Oh dear. I might have made it worse. Okay. Well, I got one little piece of tape off. What the heck? What the heck? Okay. <laughs> Don't know. There we go. I think I got it. Okay, I think I got it. Maybe. Well, that took off the tape, but... You know, I have no idea. I don't know how to get into this roller. Um, this is something that... I will have to try to figure out, but... Yeah, I have no idea. No idea. I am... Bamfoobled. Oh, wait. Oh, okay. So this is just paper. Okay, so let's see if it... Un oh, my goodness. So it enrolls in little pieces. And it is sticky. Oh, what a mess. Okay, this, this is a messy roller. What the heck? <laughs> there we go. Oh, no. It does come in parts. It all comes in parts. Oh, my goodness. So make sure you have a garbage right next to you. And not a fan blowing that's going to get it all over the place. Okay. There, I think we did it. Yep. Got it. All right. All right. So is this supposed to... So we're just going to see. I'm going to roll it across here. Oh, okay. I'm going to move you back down again. <laughs> there you go. So I'm just rolling it across. And hope I'm not shaking you too much. Well, let's put the scissors away. Let's move this out of the way. Really, really nice scraper there. I usually use that to flatten my sheets. Whoops. I think I did knock you a little bit there. Okay. Let's do it this way. So I don't really see very much of anything on here that would... We're going to look at the roller after and just see if it picked anything up. But I don't really see anything that it did pick up. Maybe a very, very little bit. Let's see. Can you see that? There's a little bit on the sides there. But yeah, overall I think my painting was pretty clean. Had one little hair there. So yeah. But it got, it did get out some of the fuzzies and stuff. I guess that was on this painting. So, now I don't know what you do after this. If you, if it, what you cover it with, probably, I'm just going to cover it with saran wrap. But yeah, I have no idea what to do with that now. It's all sticky. I think I'm going to use that on some of my clothes. <laughs> all right. So like I said, Art Dot does have a website, but they also have an Amazon. I'm going to link both their website and their Amazon into my description for you. Um, this sealer here, uh, how much was this one? $13.29. Um, if you do sign up on their website, you do will get a percentage off. They call them, um, if you subscribe, yeah. So if you subscribe on their website, so that basically means if you sign up through email, um, you will have free shipping for $35 and over. And there's also 18% loyalty rewards. Um, they have 45% off sales. So they have DB kits. They have accessories. They have beadings, jewelry, um, and crafts. Uh, let's see. What else do they have? So anyway, so... That is just some things about them. Um, Art Dot, I have heard of. Actually, they have a really nice, well, they have a nice, nice big light pad. Um, so uh, you can purchase that off of Amazon as well. And yeah, I think that's about it on regards to what I have about them. So let's start, let's start sealing my painting. Oh, I do have a code. So the code is star and I do have a referral link. 
So my code and my link will be put into the uh, description. All right. Let's do this. Oh, okay. So you open it and of course it has got another nice ceiling thing on top of here, which good thing I didn't put any on, any false nails on today because I would not have been able to get, <laughs> definitely not been able to get that stuff off that roller and definitely wouldn't be able to get into this uh, container. Um, I'm letting my nails rest a little bit. I do that every once in a while. Those uh, false nails, the glue, can really damage your nail beds. So yeah. Okay, so I do have a cloth here. I'm just going to clean this off. Alright. So I cut open a little bit of the sealer here. And just opening it here. And it is... Looks clear. So I'm just going to throw that into here. Nice and sticky. Sticky, sticky. I don't know if you can see that, but it is clear in there. Uh, I did shake it up a little bit. Maybe I should shake it up a little bit more. Actually, you know what? I'm going to give it another good shake. Um, did it say to shake? Okay, so the writing on the bottle is very, very small. So you'll need a magnifying glass to see it. I cannot read it. Um, it says larger volume, stay shining, rapid curing, non-toxic and safe and multi-purpose. So you can also use this if you do um, jigsaw puzzles. Uh, you can use it for a sealer for that as well. But yeah. So what they show is, okay, so I use the roller. Uh, my painting is all nicely lined up because I did that already. Um, it actually shows, it says pour the glue um, into the bottle, place the brush, okay, pour the glue into the bottle connector. I presume that what they're saying is you can pour the glue into the top. <laughs> and that is what we're going to do. So I'm going to pour some glue into here. Oh yeah, so it is clear. Can you see that? Nice and clear. I don't know if you can see that. Very, very clear. And we're going to start off just with this brush here. And then we are going to start off right at the top of the painting. I have to just move you up just a little bit here. And we are going to seal this one. Goes on very nice. Uh, hopefully it says what it does and doesn't take away the shine because this painting has so much beautiful shine to it. Um, Art Dots is very, I mean, they've been around for quite a while. So they have a very high rating actually. I usually, when I seal my paintings, I usually just seal them with these rubber uh, paintbrushes and I just pick them up at the Dollar Tree. But this is what they have, so I'm going to use it. So what is your favorite Disney movie? I love Pocahontas, but um, like I was saying today in my video, my favorite has always been uh, Cinderella. Of course, I'm an Eeyore fanatic. <laughs> and if you didn't know, I am having an Eeyore um, event coming up here in, um, in September. So all you need to do is have either a diamond painting, um, I'm just going to pour some out here because that's taking forever. You can either have a diamond painting, you can have um, 
You can do cross stitching, you can do knitting, you can do coloring, doesn't matter to me. Um, you just need to post your this, post your ears and of course make sure they're not completed before September 1st. And all I just want to see is your uh, progress on them. You don't even have to complete them if you can't, that's fine, I understand. Life gets in the way. And then at the end of the month, um, when everybody has submitted their paintings, and we, I'm going to look at them every week, so there will be a review of them probably on my Sunday Lives that I'm planning on doing. So yeah. Oh, that's so much easier. Okay, that works so much better. <laughs> Should have done that right from the start. Spreads very, very nice. No problem spreading. We're going to see what it looks like when it dries. Um, so I'm going to leave it over, hanging overnight. And we were going to take a look at the picture tomorrow. Um, I did get some friend mail, friend mail, so I'm going to open that tomorrow as well. So I'm really looking forward to that. Um, thank you so much for thinking about me and sending me something. Uh, you guys are just such a blessing to me. And I thank you. I don't know, I think this raccoon got a little bit too much. <laughs> but we are going to see. We're going to see what it looks like when it dries. So uh -oh. Maybe. Maybe just a little bit too much. Hopefully not. Just trying to spread it out there. So I believe this whole painting got nicely coated. It looks nicely coated. I do know that you can use baby wipes if um, I probably end up doing that is taking a little bit of this excess stuff off of this raccoon here and um, just dabbing it off but uh, I think it will, he's going to be okay. But yeah, there is my Pocahontas all nicely sealed and we will are going to look at her tomorrow and see how she turns out. I'm just going to put her over here for now. And then I brought my coasters. So I've been doing uh, one a day coasters for just Killy. Uh, she had a, um, she's got an event, or not an event, she had a challenge. She put out a challenge to do one little project every day. So I have been up with her challenge. And so I did these coasters and so I thought, yeah, let's seal them. Let's try to seal them. So that's what we're going to do. So I just do it the same way. I just take the sealer and just brush over everything. Oh, such pretty butterflies. So there's one. Oops. Let's hold on to this. And that's all I do when I seal when I do my sealing. I like that this is clear. And you can still see the shine on there. I know there's kind of a... Hopefully you can see that. The light isn't the best in here tonight. Because it's cloudy outside. What's it like in your area? Are you having? Were you having a cloudy day? Were you having a sunny day? Was it storming? I do know that there was storms going on up in Chicago area and in um, Canada. I was watching um, Evan. He does the weather, so watching him for a while this afternoon so I mean you don't need a lot you just go over it 
like I'm doing here. I hope you can see what I'm doing. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh dear. Yeah, I'll put I'll do this one on the on the ground here. Or on the table on the ground. On the table. <clears throat> These ones are just wooden backs. So I do need to get, um, whatchamacallit, I do need to get, uh, let me just move you. Maybe if I move you forward there. Um, I do need to get the backs for them. Uh, I need to order them. And then a little bit more here. And these ones will be sealed. I'm curious what it's going to do with the black. Because these butterflies are black, so I'm curious to see. If it's going to, uh, so you can see with this one already, it's, I don't know if you can tell, but hopefully it will dry clear. So I did get a little bit too much on that one, but we're going to see. So we're going to look at all these tomorrow and see how well this um, worked for sealing. Uh, thank you, Art Dot, so much for letting me try your, your product here. Um, like I said, I really like it because it's nice and clear. I'll switch up a little bit more. I really like it because it is nice and clear. Um, and it went on very nicely. Uh, very nice brush set you get in there and then again you get the silicone one and then uh, you get your little lint roller there that I'm not sure about but you get the lint roller and so yeah really really nice little package all for $13.29 really not bad not a bad price at all so go check them out use my code I don't know what the code gives you but yeah you'll find out <laughs> um, like I said, they do have a Facebook group, they have an Instagram, and they have pin, pin, Pinterest. So, and TikTok. I don't do TikTok. Um, I, I, I don't really do Instagram, but I do do Facebook, so I will go check them out on their Facebook. And I do have Pinterest, so I'll check them out on there as well. There were 600 plus that bought this item alone this past month. Um, and it is an Amazon choice. Um, uh, if you visit their art dot store on um, Amazon, they have a 4.9 rating out of five stars. So very, very highly recommended. So there you go. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Hi. So I hope you all have a wonderful, wonderful evening and enjoy it it is probably good what it's i don't even know what time it is to be honest with you um my husband and i still haven't had our supper yet so probably gonna have a special supper he did bring a little cake home so we're gonna have some cake to celebrate his birthday um another year wiser i never see another year older he's just another year wiser <laughs> so yes um so from my home to yours have a very blessed night, and as always, God's richest blessings, and I'll see you on the next one. Mwah.